Hi, Master Coders. This is Mr. Poggio. Today is your coding test. This is the basic version. I will also, in the link below, have the video to the advanced version. Here is your task. Please help scientists so that we could understand the spread of Corona. So, your Spaceland. When you set up Spaceland, you're going to want to make sure to use these blocks. Forward, create turtles, colors, setting up your colors, setting your size. Always, don't forget, you always got to delete everybody and clear terrain. So don't forget about that. So when you set up your space line, it should look like this. You should have four dots, one yellow in the origin, one red that has been teleported to the point 10, 3 on your X, Y axis. Always use zero for Z because we're not going 3D. We're staying 2D. So X, Y for red is at 10, 3 from which you will need to teleport. Your purple, you will need to teleport to negative 10, negative 2. That's why it's a bit off the Y axis right here. And lastly, you will need to go three steps backward for your blue. This is your setup. When you run your code, you will need to tell your turtles what to do. And when you run your code, you're going to need to use conditional statements because every color turtle needs to do a different thing. So your yellow is going to be heading straight in the heading of zero. So in other words, your turtle that is yellow is just going to go straight to the right and run right into the wall right here. Your red is going to be making a left turn at 30 degrees. So it's going to be making forward three and then 30 degree heading changes. So it'll make almost a perfect circle. Your purple will be doing the same thing, but moving randomly. So your purple will be making a left turn randomly up to 30 degrees. So you could see it kind of making a random circle. And your blue is going to be doing that wiggle walk forward. We're using the random to the left, random to the right. So sometimes you'll see blue come up above or in the positive for the x-axis or, excuse me, uh, value for the y-axis. Or you could possibly see it drift down because it's a wiggle. It might go in either direction. So again, you're going to want to use these conditional statements. If I am blue, then I'll be doing a wiggle walk. If I am yellow, then I'll be doing a straightforward heading walk where I'm just moving forward. Yellow is the easiest. If I'm red, I'm going in a circle at 30 degrees. And if I am purple, I'll be going randomly up to 30 degrees. So when you hit setup, it'll look like that. When you run forever, this is what your agent should be doing. Again, this is your test. Do you know code? Can you create agents? Can you tell them what to do? So one more time. When you hit setup, you'll see your space land look just like this. And then, Melody. and then when you run forever, you'll see this exact movement. And again, blue might go down. It all depends on how it's wiggle walking. But you need to complete the task for your test agents. Science needs a solution to this coding corona virus. And if you don't understand how to use your space land, you won't be able to, be able to set up your epidemic model for the research for your population for this project. So this test is up to you. Melody, can you tell students what do they have to do right now? Can you tell them take your test? Take test. That's what I'm talking about. Take your test. Melody says so.